Hi guys, welcome back to another tutorial on the Nice Tower channel. Today I'm gonna show you how to model this modern wardrobe. Before I start, like the video and share it with your friends and don't forget to subscribe our YouTube channel if you haven't already. So let's jump in. So as you see I did it before. Let me move it back right here. First, use rectangle tool and draw a rectangle right here by 130, 225, like this. And, and now use push pull tool and extrude by 50 centimeter. Then use move tool. Take this edge, press control to take a copy by 30 centimeter, like this. Again, take a copy. Let me lock the axis by arrow key and move it to the middle and divide it by two. So now, again, Take a copy from this edge, press control to take a copy, let me lock the axis, up to here, now divide it by 5, and now use offset tool, take an offset by 1.6 here 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 and here too so as you can see in here we have two thickness we don't need two thickness just we need one thickness so we can remove one of them select this surface and use a scale tool a scale one of them and this one too hold the control key to a scale from two side like this now we have just one thickness And also, let me take a copy from this surface by using Ctrl C, then use Erase tool and erase this line, and again use Offset tools and take an offset from here too. So now Use push pull tool, extrude here by 45 centimeter, like this, this one, this one, and this one too, like this. Now select all and make it group. So now go to edit menu and click on paste in place and extrude this surface by 1.6 cm. Select all and make it component. Click on create like this and here to draw a rectangle right here use line tool draw a line here and again use offset tool take an offset like this now 
select this surface and this one and delete them raise this this line now use special tool and extrude them by 1.6 like this select all and make them component click on create now use move tool and take a copy up to here now type for x and select this one use flip tool and mirror them like this let me put a material use paint bucket like this now go to inside of the component right let me draw a guideline right here by 30 centimeter use line tool draw a line 140 and once here now use arc tool and draw an arc right here like this now let me erase the guideline because we don't need it and select this edge use offset tool and take an offset by 28 centimeter or 26 centimeter like this so now let me draw a line here and also one here like this so select this line use move tool press ctrl take a copy and move it up to here now divide it by 18 now again use arc tool and draw an arc right here select this surface use move tool again press control take a copy up to here now type 17 x and enter now select this edge again and use follow me tool and just click on this surface like this so easy now select this surface use ctrl c to take a copy go out from the group and now use paste in place and extrude by two centimeter like this draw rectangle here and extrude it up to here like this we'll use that as a handle so now select the door use flip tool to take a copy of that press ctrl to take a copy and also let me mirror it now we should fix it like this how we can do it first let me 
use tape measure and tickets measure what's that 40 centimeter that's 40 centimeter let me go to inside of the group use stretch by area plugin click on it and select here now move it by 36 centimeter enter like this now that's good and now it's time to select all and again make them group and use flip tool to take another copy of that press ctrl to take a copy like this as you can see it's done i hope this tutorial was useful and helpful for you for more tutorials please subscribe our youtube channel if you haven't already and don't forget to like the video and share it with your friends